All right, well, we'll see if Evan jumps a little uh, early this time. I watched <laughs> it, and he did not. I mean, it appeared he it was that the ball was at the peak when he grabbed it. <laughs> 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 he, he had... <laughs> We'll see what happens here. 7.55 remaining. Game just started. This doesn't surprise me. They're coming out in the zone. Yeah, Cameron's probably welcome in the zone. Working the ball around. Norseman looking at it. They have Evan underneath if they just move it quickly. And there we go. Right to Evan. Evan for the layup. No good. He's going to pad his offensive stats. No. Got to have those uh, those bunnies. Jack's got to call that out, and Willie reminded him right away. Willie picks up a quick foul. Good job by the Bobcats uh, setting up that screen. That it is. It's not the start we want. 7.23 remaining in the first quarter. No score. Bobcats looking to get on the board first. That's a double dribble, it looked like to me. Bobcats are definitely, uh, they were poised. Another possible travel. Norseman fans trying to help out the call. Tip out by Stevie, nothing doing. And there's your first block of the game. Cameron, I think, had three last game. Cameron's long. He can do that. And he's doing a much better job of actually watching the ball, waiting for it to be slightly released, and then it's tip a timing it away. game. Timing. Yep. It was. Cameron stepped over the line. You can't step over the line. If, I don't know if you saw that, Tom. I didn't see it. I Cameron see. was just showing his body up high. He gets a delay of game warning. Oh! And we'll call that a steal for Jack, a <laughs> deflection by Stevie. Stevie, poor Stevie. Ow! <laughs> Willie with a nice bucket, <laughs> and they'll they'll take a quick little that was a wake up call to make sure. <laughs> That's going to sting the whole game, too. It gets worse as the game goes on. <laughs> Stevie's hearing it from the fans. Norseman strike first. 6.40 remaining. 2 nothing. Norseman lead. Near steal. Almost offensive foul there. But the Bobcats come right back and score. 2-2. Two two. 6.25 remaining here in the first quarter. Got to move the ball quick. At Stevie open. Cameron from downtown. Bam! That's what's going to happen. Because, I mean, Samna can't match up to you man-to-man. -man. They're going to have to play his own. He's got to punish him. 5-2, to two, six oh seven remaining here in the first quarter. I know the fans are getting the bams ready. Oh, Willie! Willie he lost track of where the ball was. He had it. Willie already has one foul. We don't want to pick up a second one. We have more weapons, though, than Willie. And that's a three for the Bobcats. They come right back and hit it. 5.45 remaining, 5-5. Five to five. I just don't like Near double you, dribble. You let a team kind of hang around. I know it's the beginning in here, but this is their home court. You give them momentum. Near travel there, and there's Stevie with the floater. You can't the stop bucket. that floater. I was talking to Rick on Saturday. He has that, uh, what do you call it, maybe an 8-foot, 6-foot floater. It goes in every time. Yeah, he's got an excellent floater. He's got great control of his body. Even if he gets bumped like he, we saw there, he still controlled his body well and was able to get it in. Great job by Stevie McGrath. He's only a junior. He missed both his free throws last game, and he misses this one. Actually, the second one, there was a violation. Got to hit your free throws. 7-5, to five, Norseman lead. 5-20 remaining. Another three for the Bobcats. No good. Look at Rebound Cam Battle in there. I like that. Yeah, Cam I like Battle. That too. Nice alley you pass, and you got to make those bunnies. That's two for Shomer. Two layups. And Evans kicking himself because he knows he needs to get that. And the Bobcats score again. See, so you're letting the, these guys hang around, and I think we're okay, Tommy. It's just under five minutes. Seven. I don't to seven. like it. 15-footer for Evan, no good. Evan's over. Somnox aggressive, I like it though. Out of bounds, Newark ball. 4.39 remaining, it's all tied up. 
Towson calling, uh, barking in a new play. Well, that happens sometimes. You, you get a team, I mean, every, you got a target on your back, Newark does, and, you know, these guys are going to come out a little bit. They're going to come out a little amp. That's what they're doing now. Yep. Mr. Smooth, Stevie. Yep. Stevie with the deflection causes the turnover. Switching plays up here. Look at this. Stevie bringing the ball up, going one man. Or maybe going just a two-guard front. There's Cameron from way downtown. Nothing doing. Gets his own rebound. Nice bounce pass to Willie. Willie for the layup. That's what you got to do. This is a perfect he, game for Cam if he, they're going to play he zone. He misses a three. He gets the assist because he fouled the shot. And Willie gets the bucket. Norseman up 9-7. Just under four minutes to go. Trying for another 10 count. We had one last game. Didn't get it this time. Got to rotate. And a floater. Nine to nine, 3.43 remaining. Samanak hanging around here in the first quarter. Yeah, they haven't hardly missed a shot. Willie's out of bounds. Turnover Willie. White's a little sleepwalking. I mean, they got to step it up because Samanak, they, they came to play here and you just got to. Coach Salison calls a different play, switches it up right in the middle of, of the already called play. Out of bounds. Jack wisely just shows his hand, and uh, that will cause havoc for people. I like Stevie bringing the ball up, actually. Takes a little bit of pressure off of Will, gives him a little bit more energy for those... Uh, Willie from downtown, bam! See, Salmonock's betting on that you guys, that uh, we can't shoot him out of the zone. From downtown nope. for them. Nice hustle, good hustle play by the Bobcats. See, they're getting every but loose. Jack with a block, and they get it right back. Jack with a nice defense to get the block, but... They're able to get it right back. 12 to 11, Norseman lead. Nice pass over to Jack from downtown. Nope. Off the iron. Jack follows his shot. Great job by following his shot. Out of bounds, Norseman ball. Ron Hahn over there, barking out his own plays. Well, I just want us to play with more intensity. That's something we are not showing right now. Got to get into it. Willie has it. Floats it out. I'm not sure where Jeez. he's passing it to. Had an idea. Willie in the corner. Floater. Good. <laughs> he's also got a tough floater, too. He loves that baseline. He loves that 14 baseline. 14 11. Two minutes remaining here in the first quarter. Norseman with a three point lead. Evan got caught waiting for it and turnover. Just got to give it time, let the game happen. Schmidt going to be checking in, and I think Dylan, too. One of the things nope. you're seeing, though, Newark's taking Schmitty chances, and, and they're not ca capitalizing on those chances, and they're giving these guys easy, easy lanes to the bucket. I like how you, you're going to bring Schmidt in here. He's going to give you that energy because that's what you're lacking right now. I don't know who else is checking out. I know Stevie is. I saw Stevie coming out. Well, Tom, it's 14-11, under uh, two minutes to go. Stevie and Evan sit down. Oh, Dylan came in too. Cameron, Evan. Man, we just bring in three new fresh bodies. One fifty-five remaining here in the first quarter. 14-11. Willie telling Schmidt where he needs to be. Good movement of the ball. Good quick movement. I love that. Break it down. And he's going to get a charge. Yep, that's a turnover. The guy knew he was going to do it. He anticipated it. I do not like the way this is all going. It's like we're sitting here <laughs> in a rut and you can't get out of it. 
14 to 11, 135 left, a home run play. He thought he was gonna make get some contact, but they score anyway. 14 to 13, Sam knocked down one, Willie for three, bam! Two, no, that's a two, long two. 16 to 13, just under 120 to go. And Dylan with the steal, bringing it up. Willie has it, gives it off to Dylan. Dylan being closely guarded to Willie. Willie from downtown, off the iron, rebound, Kendall. Swing it, swing it, swing it. Schmitty from the corner, bam! See, Ron knows that's the second time out. He knows that uh, you got a little bit of momentum. I mean, this, these guys, you know, the second group came in for Newark and gave them a little bit of boost. You need that little energy. And, and it's hard. I mean, even me as being a fan and, <laughs> and in here, you expect every, every time in the first quarter we should be up 22 to 2. That doesn't happen all the time. You got other kids. They're playing on their home court, Salmonac is. They got something to prove. Newark's got it. You know, I mean, they've hit credit Salmonac. They've hit their shots. Yeah, they really have. They're shooting really well. Uh, they've got a couple nice little bounces. They've hustled after it. But uh, Norseman have a six-point lead, 51.3 left. That's why you play four quarters, though. Yeah. <laughs> we, I think we always uh, want our Norseman winning by 30 or 40 points. And Nice tip by Dylan, uh, tip back by Schmitty, and then a steal by Dylan. <laughs> Willie has it. Oh. He thought about a jump shot there. Dylan for three. Bam! That's what I expected to see. <laughs> see, and you think you drop off. A lot of teams will drop off when you bring your yeah, three it, or four it, kids it, off the bench. This is just a different look. Look at that. Schmitty again. Mr. Energy. I love that. He literally bounced. I sure hope the camera got that. He literally bounced. I think that was a foul on Schmitty. Well, I like what Schmitty says. You're not going to get an easy layup. If someone's going to beat you to the rack, Schmitty came off his man, even though that wasn't his guy, and says you're not going to get an easy deuce here. Uh, Coach Tollison thinking about taking him out, but he goes, okay, I'm going to let my man go out there, stay out there. I like that foul. You make him shoot too. Don't give him the easy bucket. It sends a signal. You're not going to get anything really easy. That's what you should. Jack and Endress and them got to do the same thing. If I'm in there, you ain't getting nothing. He makes them both. 22-15. Norseman will get one last shot here. Willie has it. Gives it off to Schmitty. To Jack. Skip pass to Willie. Willie into Kendall. Kendall out to Dylan. Dylan for three. Nope. Left iron. He got his, he, we got the shot we wanted. That wasn't a bad looking shot. 22-15 at the end of the first quarter. 